chapter 23 part c question number 2 using the cost method of appraisal what will be the market value of a property with a 50000 square foot building if construction costs new are $48 per square foot and land value is in 900000 the total depreciation on the structure to date is estimated to be 10% so bottom line you need to know the formula and the formula is cost plus land minus depreciation cost of the improvement plus land minus depreciation so basically is value of the land what is the value of the land is uh, uh so the property is 50000 square foot and uh, per square foot cost is 48 So 48 multiply 50 is 2.4 million dollars. So so that is the that is the cost of the building. And minus depreciation. And uh, what is the depreciation is 10 percent. So the 10 percent depreciation of 2 2.4 million is 240 thousand. So you subtract 240 thousand dollars from 2.4 million dollars. and then you add the value of the site value of the land which is 900000 so basically you'll find your answer which is number 2 360000 so basically first find the value of the land which is 50000 multiply 48 dollars per square foot is 2.4 million then depreciation which is 10% so 10% of 2.4 million dollar is 240000 So 2.4 million minus 240,000 plus the value of the land, which is 900,000. So you, so you add all together, you'll find 3.6 million. And then we go to the question number six. Question number six. Oh, sorry, seven. Uh, go to question number seven. In the comparative method of appraisal, one method of making final adjustment to price is to use a rating grid. in using a rating grid it is most important that so comparable basically mean when you compare the property and basically for example if somebody wants to list a home from you so what are you going to do so you're going to make that house as the basis for comparison then you're going to compare all the property recently sold or recently active in the surrounding area same kind of a location so the answer is number 1 the subject property b the basis of comparison and all comparable be adjusted to it for example say you list a home which has four bedrooms so now you are comparing with other homes which has three bedroom for example rather than four sometimes you have only house with a three bedroom so then you going to deduct the cost then you going to add the cost of one bedroom if your home has as a three bathroom but the comparable property has two bathroom so then you gonna then you gonna add the price so basically the answer is number 1 the subject property b the basis of comparison and all comparable be adjusted to it so this is number 1 and then we go to the question number 14 the comparative method of appraisal is based on an analysis recent analysis of recent sale prices of similar properties which of the following best defines the word recent so this one mostly comes in exam recent recent doesn't mean the recent recent mean a a period of time where supply and demand has not changed it mean remained stable a period of time during which supply and demand conditions have not changed for example if if you list a home today for $500,000 and if you if you list one more property after 2 months if the price has not changed it remains the same so you, so you may list for the same price the similar kind of home and then we go from 14 to uh, 27 or oh, sorry 23 In using the comparative method of appraisal, the appraiser estimate the value from the evidence afforded by sale price of similar properties, which have recently been sold. 
विच ऑफ दी फॉलोइंग बेस्ट डिस्क्राइब वट इज मेंट बाई सिमिलर जस्ट लाइक वी डिड रिस सिमिलर सो सिमिलर बेसिकली मीन्स विद सिमिलर विद रिस्पेक्ट टू दो फैक्टर विच आर लाइकली टू हैव ए मटीरियल इन्फ्लुएंस ऑन द बिहेवियर ऑफ बायर्स एंड सेलर्स सो हे दी वर्ड टू रिमेमर इज मटीरियल इन्फ्लुएंस एंड द बिहेवियर मटीरियल इन्फ्लुएंस बेसिकली मीन is answer number 4 basically mean if somebody wants to buy a house in panorama ridge near the school so so he is he is not going to buy in a bridge view area so basically and the attitude and the behavior of the buyer is the most important element in making the decision but here similar means the material influence and uh, then we go back to the question number 27 and the 27 is using the comparative method of appraisal to value properties with the redevelopment potential it is not necessary that the comparable and the subject property yeah so if you have a property which has a redevelopment potential so when you change the use it doesn't mean the is present market value will become a zero so that is number 3 Have a market value of zero in their current use. That is, so that's the answer. So when you change the use, its present value does not become a zero. So this is number three. 